next to take the testosterone here. Uh, one of our best training partners, J.R. Moe, this team back at the three year layoff. Just couldn't live in the day. I couldn't. I couldn't have to All right, so he's stepping in, help me out with Sydney. Uh, Totally unintentional international thing this week with this Russian tie that's going to go into a German necktie and an Australian necktie. I shrugged this side, tapped his wrist, got the up here, bring in the waiter, got pressure on his elbow, put my weight on his shoulder. I got tight pressure right here. I like last week, instead of reacting where he comes in, this time he reacts, I'm pulling out. He pulls out, gives me the angle to shoot a double. I aim my knee right in between his legs, bring my other leg over, step off the side. Through. I cut through, I lock up the cradle. Now, all the cradle techniques I've done so far, I've always high leg over the top leg just to show you how to do go from near side cradle to the far side cradle. This week, the great thing about this technique is all I have to do is trap the bottom leg, which is easier to get. Your bottom, your opponent just thinks you're going into their half door. But the great thing is you're almost kind of eating a knee cut with the cradle locked up, so it's a strong spot. So right here, I've got the cradle. I'm bringing my other leg over. Here you're stepping your leg over your opponent's head, just like you would on a Peruvian necktie. And that prevents your opponent from getting their head to the back. Got the cradle, and I let go. Shoot through his arm. And grab this grip. I like this three quarters grip. If y'all haven't done it, it's just your thumb between your first two fingers. Any grip where I need to bring my elbows together for a squeeze, I prefer that. It takes a while to get used to, but you can just, on your free time, clap. It comes pretty quick. So. I get right here. You can do the S grip, but like I said, I'll get it there. Switch off to the three quarter grip. So from here, tap one is just bring your elbow on top, just squeeze it. That's the tap right there. I don't know how high percentage that is, but if that doesn't work, right here, you're just going to post on your head. Post on your head. This leg's going to squeeze it so you're cleaning with your legs. And right tap there, you two. have a German necktie finish. If that doesn't work, let go. This is grabbing your shin right here. And you're just going to roll. You roll over this leg, or this arm's gonna shoot through. Just bringing your other arm over behind their neck, the, clasping your hands together in the S grip, or in this case, the three quarter grip. And that's your Australian necktie. The second one's a German necktie, and this is an Australian necktie. Just different Peruvian necktie variations right here. If your opponent's been out for three years, you just Technique of the week. Sorry to those of y'all that missed Weapon X in their tight red outfit. JR's a team player and was willing, but we couldn't get him fit any time. <laughs>